there's nothing better than being able to express yourself in another language and especially language like Hebrew which is so rich and beautiful. <laughs> My name's Catherine Tobias. I've wanted to study Hebrew at university for a very long time. My name's Ben. I'm going to tell you why I study modern Hebrew at Sydney University. Hi, my name's Nat. I'm in third year Hebrew. My name is Chad Pashut. Hi, my name is Rachel Levy. My name's Michelle. My name is Nomi. I'm studying modern Hebrew at the University of Sydney. Hebrew is something that I've always had a basic knowledge and understanding of. Um, I stopped studying Hebrew at the end of year 9. I thought it would be a great opportunity to relearn and gain some of those um, Hebrew skills which I learned so long ago. I wasn't exactly the most conscientious Hebrew student in school. I dropped it the second that I could. I have done Hebrew before but that was at school and, and usually at school you're not very motivated to learn anything but this time at Sydney Uni doing modern Hebrew it's really what I want to be doing. Leaving the bubble of Mariah High School and going into university where you're anonymous is pretty confronting and scary. There's hundreds of students and you never see the same face twice. So that first day when I walked into my Hebrew class and saw this warm Israeli teacher smiling back at me, I just felt right at home. The Sydney University Hebrew program is really a great opportunity to develop your skills in the language. It doesn't just allow you to engage with the Hebrew language but with the whole of Israeli culture and Judaism. I think all people can study it and gain so much from it. I'm not of a Jewish background at all, I'm Greek, but I still absolutely love the course. I think it's a really good opportunity to do a language which for me has personal significance. Um, I lived in Israel for a year and, and I think that what would have made my trip really fulfilling is if I had known the language better. When I was just uh, in Israel over the holidays, I realized that it was something that I loved. This motivated me to come back and enroll myself in this course. I've only been learning for five weeks and I can already see the huge improvement that I've made. I studied exchange for a year in Israel when I did a Hebrew Ulpan. It couldn't have been possible without this opportunity of learning Hebrew at university. It's it's such a small and, you know, dedicated environment and everyone really wants to just do well and you make friends. There's usually a class between five or ten people and your teacher knows who you are and it's a really great conducive uh, learning environment. The relationship with the, the teacher is not really a lecturer to a student sort of just sitting there but a much more personal relationship. I started from the very start so I'd had absolutely no Hebrew knowledge before and now I can carry on a conversation with Hebrew and understand quite a bit. Before I started Hebrew 1001 um, I'd been pretty much back to square one you know being able to say Aleph, Bet, count from 1 to 10 and Kelev etc but what has been so rewarding for me personally is that in just a short time I can now write in Hebrew, I can now speak with vowels, read Hebrew and even have a basic conversation in you know, quite a fluent manner. Learning a language is a skill that you have to keep on using and I'm trying as much as I can to use Hebrew. I can really take those skills away for I guess the rest of my life, hopefully, I mean, you know, hopefully. I love Hebrew. It's really important to me and I I wanted to continue learning it and I feel so lucky that I could learn it at university. I really hope that in the future it will be something I can use as a tool um, wherever I end up in life. It's very different to school, very different and it will definitely be your fun subject. You actually get credited for this subject. You're getting a six credit points. What could be possibly be better than you know, getting credited for something that you're enjoying and studying? So I'd really recommend taking a Hebrew course at the University of Sydney. And yeah, good luck with it. Have fun. Yeah.